Hi guys, welcome to the video here to Bank Traders. I'm Logical Orange, and today we are going to take a look at the current formation for Bitcoin, which is for now pausing the whole market with a red week heading to one of the descending trend lines that is forming our sectors. this one day chart I have my sectors drawn I have drawn them several months ago and they are being respected pretty much to the letter and we can see that sometimes they are confluential with other um, oscillators or other indicators in the chart in this case the last candle that we see here the current candle has rejected with the week near a fib level so near the 0 0.23 Fibonacci level so we can consider this area right here as a confidential zone so now we can consider also that upon closing this candle we are uh, we will be uh, trading inside this big sector right here that has a high of 50.5k uh, and the potential low of 46.5k so this is the current section the sector we are in right now but the candle is not closed on the daily time frame we still have some time on it uh, it is pretty fat right now so we have a lot of chances of closing inside this formation but if we do i also suspect that with the current trend that is generally a reverse trend right here we have a lot of chances of um, closing somewhere around here maybe even lower and then with another candle uh, play around with the fib level and retest the upper part of the sector which is also confidential with the fib pivot uh, also we are closed above the 200 ma extremely important for me on the long term this is a very very good entry price anywhere around here anywhere around here or the long term so if we go on the smaller time frames like for example the four hour chart we can see that we have a pattern that's looking like a curve we can also also consider this right here like a cap and handle it's not really the best looking cap and handle i've seen but it can be considered like one so this would be the cup and this would be the handle now this rejection right here doesn't make sense in this formation so it's not a hundred percent sure that this uh this formation is valid however we do have some curve right here so curvature right here we need to take down targets into consideration because uh before a good pump we need to have a shakeout we had this uh several times right here but we still need one last more i think and um it can it can happen uh before pumping this could have been it but i think that we will just try once more we will try to deleverage the market before moving in completely so before moving into a completely bullish cycle for the four hour, four hour six hour chart okay so if we talk about down targets well first of all let's see where our volume profile is for the current formation which is pretty clear it, it starts after the drop uh well vpvr local right here so uh confirms that the price might turn uh from here uh so the the direction would be upwards directly straight from here this is a possibility and uh i will not remove that possibility now if you want to take a look at the lower targets we need to look at the major pivots supports resistances now we have the fibonacci ones right here and uh, they correlate pretty much with the price action that has happened before of course so we have we can say that 46 47 is a level to watch right here going to note it uh, then of course we have the fat week candle close right here which is important it is confidential with uh, the sending trend line 45.9 i really don't think that we will get this far uh, however a retest of this type of um, of level right here so the mid level 47k is still possible now today is um thursday no is it thursday 
today is Tuesday. Today is Tuesday. So we still have a lot of time in the week uh, to, to gather some strength and go to the upside. Now, end of the, the end, the, the, the end of the year. Now, the end of the year is not uh, a very good example for trading because it's a bit chaotic. Uh, usually it doesn't have a lot of volume and um, well, institutionals don't really trade that much. They do trade, but not as they would in normal trading weeks. I expect that come January, we will have a uh, good volume and a good, def well-defined direction uh, for now. So to resume, lower targets, 47 and 45.46, let's say 46 confidential area right here. Uh, we could potentially reject based on the volume profile from here. So this is also a possibility. We are now close just below this Fibonacci fib level right here. Then we would have some resistance on this ascending trend line. Then we would have some more resistance out of the, e, uh, the MA200. If we closed uh, above it, and we get out of this sector right here, which is extremely important right now. So this sector is the most important right now. It has a high of 51.5 and uh, well, the low is dynamic, as you can see. If we get out of this sector above this area, so another FIB level right here, 51.7, 51.8. If we close above this, we confirm our trend and we can place some pretty sweet entries for the longer term because right now we are mainly trading scalp trades and altcoins that are pumping somewhat independently uh, for, uh, related to bitcoin my personal take on this is that we will reject from here and we will possibly sideways a bit before going into this sector and then trying to release the price on the upside this is all for today, guys. Thank you for watching. This is Logical Orange for Sublime Traders. This was a Bitcoin update, the last Bitcoin update for the year.